Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Joel Young. Thank you so much for joining us right here on the Jumpstart Video channel. We are so excited to be able to share some great tips and tricks with you. Today is no different. We are gonna share with you how to make sure that you're doing video marketing in the coronavirus days or during the pandemic. What, what are we calling these? You tell me down in the comments. What are you calling these days? How to do it correctly or maybe how we should view it from this point on because this whole situation worldwide, huge impact. It's changed the way every single one of us does our daily business. Whether you work for a company that has 5,000 people or just five people on the team, it's changed the way you communicate. It's changed the way that you reach your customers. It's changed the way you execute and do your job every single day. And I believe there are gonna be lasting changes that stick with us long after this time. And every single day, we're getting this question from our clients. Hey, what do we do during this pandemic? What do we do during this time when we can't get into our offices, we can't get to our customers? How do we market to our customers effectively in a way that doesn't seem like we're taking advantage of the situation? It doesn't seem insensitive or pandering. What do we do? And so today I wanna to talk about some keys to video marketing in this pandemic time, in this new time, and really in this new era of digital and video marketing. The first thing I'd like to say is that no matter what your company or organization looks like, your video marketing presence is more important now than ever. You have to develop a personality for your company, for your business. You have to convey quality. You have to do all of these things via video. They're not gonna work in written text. It's not gonna work as a lead page. You have to have something living, breathing, moving, talking right in front of people. And I believe it's more important than ever to have a human element in your video marketing. Whether it's a real person, whether it's an animation about a person, it's a narrative, it's a story, you need to have a human element in your video marketing to make that personal touch that you can't make anymore in person. So whatever you're doing, realize that you have to have a voice via video marketing or you won't exist tomorrow and you have to make that voice as personal as possible. Sometimes that means making the company owner, like myself, uh, the face of your company. We do a lot of work where I'm in it because I wanna make sure that you know we're real people doing real work. We really know what we're doing. As the owner and founder of this company, I am in the work every single day and yet uh, I still need to make videos like this to connect with you to let you know we're real people and we're here for you. We wanna help you just the same way you wanna help your customers. So put a face on it, consistency. If it's nobody in your company, a, a, a business like ours can provide you with a spokesperson that's steady, that that spokesperson can be your spokesperson throughout the entirety of your campaign or this time, or you know, maybe for a long period in the future. We've done that for many clients. Uh, or you need to develop maybe an animated character that, you know, this is John and he's your character and everything is told through the story of John and his life. Whatever it is, make sure that you, you create a presence, that it's personal, and this is important, that you find your voice. Now, now this is something that is maybe more important than ever in this time is that you do something that's authentic. You don't do something just because you see other people doing it. You don't do something to um, make yourself look a certain way. You do something to actually be transparent and portray yourself in not just the best light possible, but in the most authentic light possible. Find your voice. I want to encourage you not to shy away from humor. People need humor in these times. We need humor in our marketing still. We can't be stiff. We can't be all business all the time. Humor is the spice of life. It's what makes us human. And I believe it's what brings the spark to our mind and to our eye and causes people to want to get involved with us and our services in the first place. That connection. And a lot of times humor can be that. But if humor is not your voice, if that's inappropriate in your business, which maybe if you run a funeral home, you might. Uh, we've worked for funeral directors, funeral homes. Humor might not be your best option, but find a way to be authentic. Be yourself. Be whoever you are when there's no camera rolling, when there's no video playing. Be who you are, who you are every day and people will see that and be interested in, in using your services, working with your company, 
uh, in your organization, no matter what you're saying or, or really uh, when you're saying it, whether it's during a pandemic or when things are returned to normal. The next thing I want to encourage you to do during this time especially is be consistent. Now, I realize for a lot of you, you've had your day-to-day -day operations taken away. Like we said, if you run a ballet studio, you're not able to offer classes in person. You were probably doing that every day. That's gone. You have to figure out a way to be consistent in what you're offering people digitally, online, via video. It needs to be something they can count on just like your services were in person during this time when it can't be what it used to be. So I would encourage you, if you choose to do some kind of marketing, don't just say, we're gonna make a video, we're gonna do this one thing, and then maybe later we'll do another thing. No, say, we're gonna do this every month, once a month, probably not enough. Maybe you say, we're gonna do this every week, one video a week, that, that's a good place to start. We're gonna do something every week, be consistent. Hey, every single Wednesday, we're gonna do this. Maybe for some of you, it's every day. Maybe you need to get online, get on, on live uh, broadcasts with the, your audience somehow and talk to them every day, stay connected. Whatever it is, be consistent. It doesn't always need to be fully produced and beautiful and huge. You know, certainly if you wanna produce something that looks great, we can help you, but there are times when you need to strip it down just to be authentic and to be consistent. Do a, a live video on your phone. For goodness sake, use a microphone, put it on a tripod, but be authentic in the best possible way you can and be consistent. The last thing I wanna encourage you to do, especially during this time, and keeping this in mind as you're moving forward because it's really important, is to choose a platform. One, maybe two platforms that you focus hard on, where you think your customers are interacting with you the most, where there's the most potential. Now this is not me saying, you know, Pick a platform, never change, don't adapt, stay with one thing forever, it's always gonna work. No, that, this is me saying I would rather you be better on one platform, have a great presence, than have a mediocre presence on all of them. For instance, in our business, many of our customers are on Facebook. That's why we do a lot of our reviews, we do a lot of posting on Facebook, we also connect with customers on LinkedIn, and we use YouTube. Those are the only three that we use, and we try to make sure that we're as as focused on those three platforms as we can possibly be. You need to figure out what your one platform is to start with, your main platform, and then maybe your second. If you have a great strategy, maybe go with three, but I would say limit it. Make sure that you're doing a great job at whatever you're, you're posting consistently. Choose a platform, choose a couple platforms that you think it's gonna be most effective in, and don't worry about the rest for now. Build your presence where it is, because if you have an audience that's interested in what you're doing, they're gonna find you and they're gonna stay with you right there wherever you are. Hey, thank you so much for joining me for this tip video. My name is Joel Young. I'm the owner and creative director here at jumpstartvideo.net. We create fun marketing, explainer, animation, motion graphic videos, videos of all kinds. If you have any need for that, just go on over to jumpstartvideo.net. Check us out. We would love to help you. And if you're interested in more video marketing tips just like this, subscribe down below. We're posting new videos every single week, so make sure you don't miss out on a single one. Until next time, keep doing because the future favors the doers.